Hey, what is up everyone? Today I have a short but informative video for you to improve the performance on your Lenovo Legion laptop. Now most of this works for all the models and will significantly improve the performance and the temperatures. Let me show you how I set my laptops up. Now I always start off with making sure all my drivers are up to date and this might be a big duh for most of you, but you would be surprised at how many people don't update their systems. Now there's usually three kind of updates I'm looking at. I like to look at the Lenovo software, it's update. It's a little you know, icon down here, which you can click. If you go to system update, you will find your updates. Just check for updates and usually it will find something. Now update that. If you have done that, um, go to your Windows update. So just, you know, go to Windows update, find the updates over here. Also make sure to go to advanced options and look for optional updates. Just update everything. The third kind of updates you always have to do is make sure your GPU is up to date. Just go to over here, right click on GeForce Experience, open it and just make sure the drivers over here are up to date. So the next and most important step is to open your Lenovo Legion Vantage software and find your hybrid mode. Make sure it's turned off. It requires a reboot. If you turn this on, the gaming performance is gonna be significantly less as you are using your iGPU instead of your dedicated GPU. Now, while you are still in the Lenovo Vantage software, make sure you have either performance mode or balance mode selected. These offer the best performance for gaming. You can change this by pressing the FN plus Q button. Now most Legion laptops come pre-installed with McAfee software. Personally, I would recommend you to remove it as it highly affects your gaming performance. Just follow these steps, go to apps, features, and make sure from this list, which I have already done, you find McAfee and everything with McAfee in it and you delete it and you don't install it back because this highly, highly affects the performance of your system. Now the next thing you wanna do is, is you wanna press Control Alt Delete and go to Task Manager. You will get a screen like this. Go to More Options, go to Startup over here and make sure you disable all the apps you do not want to start up when you boot up your computer. And there's a lot of apps here that will start up, which also in their own turn affect your performance. Now the next thing I always do is, is I go to the search bar, type in graphic settings, go to change default graphic settings and make sure your hardware accelerated GPU scheduling is turned on. You also wanna be checking out in your GeForce experience if you do not have the whisper mode or battery boost mode turned on. These, as you can see, do affect your performance. Personally, I like to use the overlay, but if you do not use it, you can turn it off. If you do have it turned on, go to the menu or to your main screen and press Alt Z, then go to settings and make sure highlights is turned off. If you don't turn this off, your laptop will be constantly recording highlights, unless you want this, but turning this off increases your performance. Now, if this video was any useful, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. That helps me out greatly. Now, my last tip for you guys is make sure you raise the bottom end of the laptop. This works for all laptops, but it just helps the inflow of air from the bottom. If you would place it flat on the table or like on the surface of a bed, your thermals are gonna be much worse. Go test it out yourself and thank you so much for watching.